games wise it's me wisecrack and in today's episode we are going to talk about the ash and his stealth ability now look at this he looks like the stalker I made him all look like the stalker but now the mods let's first begin with steel charge and because I want a lot of efficiency I have my streamline mod installed then duration is very important for my stealth build so I got my narrow minded equipped, my continuity equipped and of course constitution is equipped as well. Then I got intensify for some power strength. I got rage so I have even more energy to use my smoke screen. Then flow for some power max and vigor so I have some shield and health. Why not? Why the hell not? Let's just be safe for once, okay? Now let's check this build out. Now let us just try a random assassination mission. Let's do one on Earth and kill Vehek and use my smoke screen uh, once in a while. And uh, don't forget to enjoy. As you can see, the smoke screen can be very useful at times. It even stuns your enemies when you use it. But it only lasts for 18 seconds, and that's not a lot. But it's enough to do the job. Because I'm so fucking awesome, I decided to make another build in one video. You get two for one this time. And you ask me, well, what are you gonna give us? Well, look at this. Bam! Smoke! Shadow, now the whole team is invisible. And let's check that one out. Can you see it? He is invisible, just like me. But, as you can see, he has to be close to me when I activate it. You see, my other teammate is still visible. But this limbo right here isn't. Look at this. Think of all the possibilities. Well, now we're gonna take out this uh, this boss, and I'm trying to get my teammates all together so I can make them invisible. But it's harder than it looks. 
But never mind. Still, I'm invisible, and, and one of my teammates is. And here's the boss. It's Vor. The old dirty bastard himself. I don't know why he's flying around. That was very, very weird. And uh, yeah, here we go, invisible again. And um, as you can see, Boar is nowhere to be seen. It's because he is invisible himself. He's somewhere around here. I cannot see him, and he's dead. Well, that was uh, interesting. Well, now I got all my teammates all together, and now you can see that we are all invisible. Isn't that great? Well, you could think of all those creative things you can do with this. The possibilities are endless. But I went to do a capture mission. Multiple targets of interest for this mission. Bring them all to me. If we are all invisible, it can be even more efficient. But as you can see, my teammates left me and I had to do it all alone. But if you have friends, you can use this mod to make your friends and yourself invisible and have fun. I hope you enjoyed this and I'll see you in the next one. Adios. Check this hammer out. Let's check out the pros and the cons of this build. First off, the pros. It has a 5 meter area of effect knockdown. Jump attack. It can hit multiple enemies at once it has a good critical chance and as I said it has a knockdown and when those enemies are knocked down you can finish them off very easily and of course I said it's good so it is good